Back again with another unboxing video of the Creation Crate. This is the fourth month to the subscription box service from Creation Crate. And before I begin, I would just like to thank you viewers for watching the past unboxing tutorials of the Creation Crate subscription box. All right, so let's see what's inside. An LED dice game. And as always, separate each wire. Don't forget, don't forget. So, inside our box we have the instruction manual as always, along with these really cool stickers, Tech Inspired, I Am a Maker, another Arduino Uno of course, more resistors, breadboard, all of the LEDs and buttons and other pieces that we will need for this project. So now that we have all the parts, let's get started on putting this together. Welcome to month four. What are we creating? Take a chance, test your luck. Introducing this month's build, the LED Dice Game. Push the button to roll the dice, roll a 2, 7, or 12 to win. What's new this month? The hardware setup will be similar to previous projects, all but slightly trickier. I think that's all but, there's a little typo there. The programming section is where the challenge is this month. You will have to fill in the blanks to make the project run. And as always, they have a support page for any extra help you may need. Now, before you get too far with your building, you will want to make sure that the positive and negative side of your LED corresponds correctly. And the positive side is the longer side, so keep that in mind. I always bend the positive side outwards. That always helps me when it comes to remembering which is what. All right, so I'm really starting to question why I waited to put these orange wires in after plugging everything else in. So that's my suggestion to you if you are putting together this kit as you are watching this video. I would advise you to first lay down all of the orange wires, then your LEDs and everything else. It's, I just don't know why I didn't think of that sooner. All right, so we have uploaded the software. Fingers crossed. Hey, it looks like it works. Uh-oh, something's not working. The wires were touching, so be careful of that. Make sure none of the wires are touching. It was shorting out there. Hey, we want to roll a two, a seven, or a 12. One. Another one. So this is something you could play with, obviously, other people, a team of people. Go around the board, have everyone roll. So now that we have our own electronic die, that is the singular of dice, we can play a whole host of dice games. And in the back, as always, there is a monthly challenge and some exercises. This month's challenge is adding a second die, which you could do. Uh, you just double the commands, essentially. Anyone with a past month case would be able to use their wires from a past month to add the second die to get dice. So one, you can add the ability to roll a seven on a single die. Two, you could make the dice blink twice when you roll a six. And three, you could remove the jumper wire that connects the two blue power rails and roll the dice. What happens? Explain the reason for this happening. And last but not least, there is a bonus exercise, but I will let you buy this product to figure out what that is. Play this a little more. Boom, two. One again, I'm so good at this game. All right, so thank you so much for watching. As always, please feel free to leave a like, check out my other videos, and subscribe.